Jay, I really needed this today. I, I am exhausted. My body is so achy and so tired. And we are about to get ready to do another turn of the expander. I've had like two days off and now I'm gonna to have to do it again. So I'm not looking forward to the pain. Honestly, sharing this whole tongue tie journey and the Marpy expander, it's the thing that's keeping me sane so that I can at least just get it all out. Like, you know, it's funny. My daughter's like, mom, now you're like, you're all you're talking now is just like your pain. I'm not that girl. I'm not that girl that like, it's the pain. But you know what? When you've got mouth pain, it's hard to ignore. But she's like, mom, even she's like, mom, if I don't cook for you, then you're not eating. Now, eating is not fun anymore, Jay, at all, because not only have that up there, but you see, there's metal underneath the teeth. So when I chew, aside from being sore, when I chew, it is like I'm chewing with metal pans. That's what it feels like. Nothing, it doesn't matter what the food is, how delicious it might taste, because that metal is in there, it sucks the joy out of the experience. So my daughter's like, you know, mom, I think we just need to make a list of food that you can eat. Kind of just have it lined up. She's been, tonight she's making me beans and rice. We're gonna I'm probably eat on that all weekend. I said, I don't really care what I eat. As long as it's easy to eat. At this point, it's just get the calories in so that I can function and then move on. And hopefully, you know what? I'm gonna celebrate when I get this out in about seven months or so. I am gonna celebrate like nobody's business. I'm gonna eat everything. You don't realize, you don't realize how valuable your chompers are, your teeth are until they're compromised. And so Jay, I'm gonna keep sharing my experience to keep me sane and to help others. I know I'm probably scaring people, but I have to be honest, like this experience isn't, hasn't been like all roses. I wish that it had been or that it has been, but it hasn't and that's okay. But I know the end result, the end result of the pain relief, the tongue tie release. I've got to think that all of this pain and drama in my mouth is worth all of it to be able to breathe better. And I am, I am breathing better. It's like amazing, amazing. My lungs are filling up more, just that little gap. So I'm sure by the next, uh, the next couple of days, this gap is gonna be bigger. Okay, I'm gonna go get psyched up. I need to go eat something and then my daughter is gonna be home and then we're going to turn the Murphy. I'm gonna make sure I take, oh, I need to take Moltrin. If I take, I've learned, if I take Moltrin about an hour before, Tylenol, ugh, not good, but I take it anyway in between. But Moltrin is the trick about an hour before that I do the turn, it is so helpful. And then I'll make sure I take something at night before bed because inevitably you think you're gonna just go to sleep with the pain, it'll just go, no. That pain, it's like it starts to have a party, like a late night rave when you put your head on the pillow. Okay, I'm gonna go check and see if my beans and rice are soft enough for me to consume right now. And Jay, and all those out there that have been so freaking nice to me, thank you guys for listening to all my drama. You don't know what it means to have you guys out there supporting me. It really means so much. It means so much. Okay, I'm gonna go eat some rice and beans now.